Jesus blesses the children. Zacchaeus was like a child, dropping his dignity in order to catch a glimpse of Jesus. The condition of entering the kingdom of heaven is to become like a child, and Zacchaeus entered it there and then. Jesus' followers were familiar with his insistence on the need to become like children again in simplicity and trust, newly born. Only then can we truly call God our Father and be brothers and sisters of Jesus sharing his life. Jesus identified with the children he gathered around him in order that they might identify with him. Here the kingdom of God has come about. It's as simple and close to us as that. Yet, to be small and insignificant has never been an attractive option, and it is still less so today. From the Gospel of Mark, let the little children come to me. Imagine you are one of the children in the picture. Jesus has been talking to the grown-ups in your village all day. It's early evening and the sun is just starting to set. Nearly the whole village has ended up in the marketplace. They've been sitting, listening to Jesus. You've never known everybody to be so quiet. Jesus talked about his Father and the Kingdom of Heaven. He said the Kingdom of Heaven isn't a place, it's a way you have to be. Jesus says it is time to stop being big and powerful. Start being happy, kind and doing what you know is right. The crowd is starting to move closer to Jesus. Some mothers are carrying their babies and asking him to touch and bless them. Jesus looks tired, but friendly. Make your way to Jesus now. Squeeze past people. You may even need to get down on your hands and knees and crawl through the people's legs. You are getting closer. Listen to the children laughing and giggling. At last you reach Jesus. He puts his hand gently on your shoulder and for a moment you can't hear the shouting and laughing. It's just you and Jesus. The noises around you are changing. You can hear angry shouting. The disciples are cross. They think Jesus should be left alone. Look at Jesus' face. What does he think? You remember what Jesus said about the kingdom of heaven and not believing you are more important than someone else? Have the disciples understood this? You decide it is time to go, but know you will see Jesus again. What will you say next time you meet?
How do you feel when someone is rude to you? What does it feel like when adults stop you from doing something you want to do? Are adults always right? Does anyone make you feel small? Why? What can you do to show people you are special? How would Jesus like you to behave? Why is Jesus your special friend?